Okay. <clears throat> so this is a little bit better. Um, I had the other music one, but it was a little bit softer. Even though the bells, the bowls were in the background, the singing bowls. Like, I really like that, but the music wasn't, it didn't resonate with what I was really feeling. Like, I said it. I got like this really fleshy feeling that like kind of washed over. I was like, yeah, I have to change this music because it wasn't something wasn't right. Somebody could be feeling something that's like really deep within that just isn't right, but they're not realizing exactly what it is you know somebody is feeling or it might not even just be that it may not be right it's like um you get a feeling but you're not understanding what it is on the inside you know so it's like something we're towards you're trying to figure it figure something out something's not making sense if that makes sense to the gym today everything is freaking awesome okay um the weight is feeling awesome everything's really good um, five is probably one of the first in my fifty six could also be a number for somebody we have the six of wands and the upright. All right, this is somebody that's moving forward. Somebody that's heading in. Um, that's like their focus is in one direction. Okay. Having um. Having help along the way. I was looking at it at first to say options, but I'm not seeing options. This is more like guidance. Somebody has good karma, well, dharma. Enlightened about something, situations, their surroundings. Shuffled and everything and it still came out, yeah. Yeah, somebody is enlightened to a situation um, could have gotten enlightenment which brung them into their dharma state instead of keeping them, you know, clearing out karma. Okay? Um, we all know what goes around comes around. So, it looks like this one went around and now they got their world in the outright. <clears throat> So we're gonna keep that on the board. That's something else. Um, behind the scenes, we do have secrets. Okay, this isn't this energy that's on the table, but this is something that is attached in some sort of way to this energy. This could be somebody that's within their energy, but not necessarily this one that's on the table. Okay, feminine, masculine. Take it however it resonates for you. Um, I'm just seeing somebody moving forward. Their world is in the upright. Okay, they're going right into fulfillment. Um, it's like they, um, are basically, uh, finally taking hold of the pen to their own paper, you know? Pen to the pad. So, like I said, somebody attached to this energy, okay, has some secrets, okay, that somebody gotten enlightenment 
this energy right here is about enlightenment and they got put into their dharma so it could have been somebody that was connected that had some sort of secrets that had this person at some given point in the knight of swords um yeah the the nine of swords the thing is is coming out in reverse which means yeah they're they weren't losing any sleep over this it was something they wasn't clear about they couldn't put a finger on it some somebody that was attached to this energy that's on the table they couldn't put a finger on their on what wasn't right about this individual that's within this deck right here okay this energy but they wasn't losing any sleep over it they weren't lost about it but maybe they were trying to find out what kind of secrets was being held okay and they were being very patient okay <clears throat> very patient but not intending to move forward this is the person that don't show their hand not in any way shape or form like if you talk about a fucking poker face this is a poker face like no other okay <laughs> and this person laughs at that shit too they find that hilarious because they know they know they're like oh my shit like I know better because if I even try to creep around, I'm gonna be sniffed out. Somebody can be sniffed out. Okay, yeah, we got a tower moment. Okay, but it's in the reverse. It's in the reverse because the world is in the upright. Somebody wanted a tower moment for this individual over here. Okay, but it didn't happen. Tower moment is in the reverse. That's why the world is coming into their favor. Somebody was trying to be sneaky. And I was holding the damn card. 702 is on the clock. Alright, so the tower moment was in reverse, which means they got the world in their favor. They got their dawn and they're walking into it, you know, straightforward, you know, in guidance. We have honesty, feasting, um, giving energy. This is somebody who sets, who sets the table, basically, you know. They bring it, they brought it, they are it. Why do you have to buy it when you are it? You don't have to buy shit, because you are it. This is their table. These are their cups. Okay. This is what they offer. You know, they, they show it all right here in the forefront. Okay. Very honest. Open. Um, you know, this is the energy that stands. Or not, well, they could stand, but they they sit within their energy and they do not, you know, venture out of it for no good reason you know um yeah now here we have a connection we have the full in reverse and we have the king of swords in reverse and um this is what i'm getting that was trying to cause a tower moment Okay, King of Swords in reverse. Um, this energy right here is in the outright. This is that, you know, festive feasting energy that's, you know, all that giving and goodness and everything that it embodies. And there was a King of Swords that's just basically the opposite of those cups. They're not giving. They're not sharing their feast. They're not into, you know, all that. What they're doing is they are going to get up and show their ass <clears throat> okay if um it's not for anything just but for others to kiss we have the full in reverse this is a very foolish and nasty individual okay um this person is not a risk taker they're more in um Plots and planning out, okay, but they're not strategic within their actions because the King of Swords in the reverse, um, you know, they're not using their discernment, they're not using their 
uh, gets within uh, spotting out character and acting accordingly. No, they're in it for the ego. You know, they wanted that boost. That's all it is. We have 1004. 104. That's what it is. 104. 10 could be significant. 4 could be a number for somebody. 4, you know, is basically stability, but it could also bring that. Seven of Wands in reverse. Seven of Wands in reverse. Okay, this is something different right here. This isn't attached. Somebody lost their footing somewhere. Okay. <coughs> oh, oh, shit. What is it with this energy? We have the Page of Cups. Stuck in a Page of Cups. Stuck in a Page of Cups. Stuck in a Page of Cups. This is the energy that they carry. They carry the energy of a page of cups. Somebody that comes in with like um, the right shit to say. What the person comes in with the right things to say right they do this in order to get into some sort of partnerships okay we have the hierophant in the reverse this isn't a divine guidance of any sorts okay um somebody just they they know what to do they know the right things to say they know but they just use it in in deceit nine of pentacles this is a single individual Okay, this is somebody that um basically does and has everything that they could ever want to walk in on a step for, you know, that type of counterpart. But the thing is, they're deceitful in the ways that they go about getting it. Okay. Queen of Swords in the reverse. We have the Ten of Cups in the upright. So, again, Queen of Swords in the reverse. Very bitchy type of individual. Um, very judgmental. You know, a throat cutter of, you know, somebody who will have no problem with, you know, splitting you right down the middle and exposing you. This is somebody that um, is very, very cruel, very harsh, but they want fulfillment. So they want fulfillment of something, and this isn't a family fulfillment. They want fulfillment of, of satisfaction. Satisfaction of... Satisfaction. We'll clarify that in a second. 1404. Could be a number for somebody. We have the two of swords in the reverse. We have justice in reverse. And we have the eight of wands in the upright. Somebody was blinded to um, these obstacles. Okay. That were set forth. There was some sort of attacks. Some Something was... Uh, being done behind the scenes like i said this is a nasty individual that wanted fulfillment this is somebody that does any and everything to get what they want male or female energy is energy all right take it however it resonates you can um just you know turn it around for um 
whoever it fits for for you you know if you're this queen of swords in the reverse you know <laughs> if you're this you know type of tactical <laughs> sob you know um but yeah justice something blind justice blinded justice something wasn't blind but something was unjust They tried to balance scales in their favor. They did something. They did something that wasn't that wasn't of 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 truth. They did something that was um They did something trying to take justice into their own hands. That just basically backfired on them. And they were blinded to this. Third party situation. Justice. Not blinded. Unblind, unblind justice. The fuck? Unblinded. Not blinded. These guys are blind. Justice is blind. But they didn't want justice to be blind. They want justice to go in their face. This is somebody that didn't want justice to stay blind. Justice is supposed to be blind. You're not supposed to sit here and, and you know, um, justify a situation when, you know, um, color, creed, religion, sex, whatever, right? This is a person who was trying to get justice in their favor by doing just the opposite. They were trying to have it being looked at as, well, you know, as, you know, for their, you know, sexual, sexual sex, um creed, religion, whatever they are, you know, they were trying to use justice to see them in a way to in, to get their justice. That's what they were trying to do. Okay? They didn't want justice to be blind. But we do have a third party situation that fell right over this justice and this two of swords in the reverse. Okay, something that uh, that was not really hidden very well is a third party situation. And we have the Knight of Swords in the right? And this is basically somebody that does things without thinking about it, basically. You know, uh, very quick and coming in and, you know, just giving their two cents and then, you know, leaving back out again. Just the in and out energy. And this is somebody that does not think about what they are doing or saying in the midst of doing and saying the things that they are doing and saying that are basically screwing them over. Remember these cards, they come out on top of where they need to fall. Somebody, somebody, they, um, they didn't realize that something was going to be seen. But it was somebody within this third party situation. Okay. They didn't know. They could have possibly been, possibly been handling whoever this Knight of Swords energy is and having them come in and out with um, this type of harsh you know communication connection what have you all right somebody from this third party situation was trying to screw somebody over didn't want them to um, go ahead so basically they caused um, some sort of attacks okay and like I said this Queen of Swords over here 
And this energy is in that this person does any and everything for fulfillment for themselves. Okay. And that's me. That either means coming in with, you know, information and, and giving, you know, giving information of some sorts, you know, giving little things to, you know, keep people here in that bay and handle them properly, you know, to, to, to their will. Okay. This person doesn't like this to be talked about. This person has like a, a, a flighty type of a heart rate. You know, it's kind of fluttery, fluttery. Somebody's heart is like fluttery, fluttery. Not good fluttery, but it's like that anxiety type of like, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Okay. Frog in the throat. Not being able to speak. They're realizing things are catching up. They didn't expect this to happen. They really didn't. Okay. Alright. Um, let me get one more card, if anything. Uh, these are two situations that are on the board, on the uh, table right now. So whoever uh, this manipulative energy is that is on this board, um, the karma's in the devil's in. Karma's in the devil's in. Okay. Somebody is going to be experiencing some more karma. We have air and earth. Air and earth signs. I don't know why I just got that. Air and earth. As above, so below. Alright, so that's the reading. Okay. Uh, we got 2022. On the call. Not 2022, 2222 22 is on the clock. What the fuck? Okay, somebody is, um, could be messing with their words too. Um, who's within a situation? Um, okay, so, um, take it however it resonates and, uh, just stay, you know, truthful with, um, your stuff and be careful with everything that you're doing out there. And I hope that, you know, this helps out somebody. I hope that this uh, kind of resonated. If it did, like it. If it didn't, like it anyway. You watched it. It's cool if you don't. It's all right if you do. I love you either way. All right. So um yeah. So have a good night, and uh, I will talk to you guys uh tomorrow. Okay. Bye.